Yo, what's up, everybody? Time for some OAA. Yeah, I don't know, like, just chilling. This is a fun game. I enjoy it. You guys actually like watching it, which is great. <laughs> and it's always nice to do it on stream like this, because, like, I'm currently streaming, right? Um, I'm recording this for YouTube, but uh, with the stream overlay and everything, because I think it's cool this way, since I can't just, like, directly interact and, like, answer questions and all of that. And also, apparently, people feel like subscribing right now. So thank you, Six Thing. Very much appreciate that. But anyway, we're playing Wraith King right here because I just kind of like want to be like really rude with Wraith King. Get that crit, boy! <laughs> that was a good crit. I like that. First hit off the game and it's a crit. Good sign right there. Good sign. Now, uh, we're still really dead. Quite dead, I would say. Like, almost certainly just don't stand a chance, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, so, as I was saying, as I was saying, we're gonna be playing uh, Wraith King here, and I wanna go like Agonims and Octarine Core and Radiance and shit. And Refresher. And, well, Octarine Core and Refresher are the same thing. But, you know, like combine these and just go super hard on people. <laughs> I think that sounds like a lot of fun. Just being the most annoying Wraith King you can possibly be. Become the Wraith King. Become the Wraith King. Wait, does that imply Frey's annoying? That's not what I meant. Sorry, Frey. Also, you stealer people. Stop stealing other people's creeps. Get out of here. Stop it. Can somebody come and help me with this? This is a real problem. <laughs> oh, no, I'm dead. I am dead. That's kind of scary. Hmm. That is kind of scary. What's the cooldown for max level reincarnation? It is uh, 40 seconds. We don't change that. The problem with changing that is that if it becomes too low, and it doesn't really like... And by too low, it really needs to only be mildly lower than it currently is. Um, it actually becomes impossible to kill Wraith King, like ever. <laughs> Which is why we can't really change the cooldown on that. Um, so we, we try to like buff it in other ways, but it's a really difficult ability to scale up. Right, like, some abilities are really easy to scale up. Like, for example, Lina Ultimate. It's just like, well, this just does more damage now, right? Like, it doesn't really have another effect. But uh, Wraith King's Ultimate is just like, well, if we reduce the cooldown just even a little bit more, then it becomes impossible to kill him. Right, you just can't do it anymore, because if he goes for the proper items, he will just be literally impossible to kill. So we probably don't want to do that. <laughs> oh my god. Can you people, like, chill? Man, these are not giving me a break here. Alright, alright, alright. I go and grab myself some boots of speed. And see how we can go from here. So what we did, instead of making the reincarnation lower, is we have improved the slow duration. And we have reduced the reincarnation time. So... The three seconds it usually takes to reincarnate go slower, and the slow lasts longer. Right, like that's how we buffed it. But you can't buff the cooldown, because that becomes really difficult. <laughs> that, that just becomes a big, big problem. So yeah. Something we kind of uh, want to try and avoid, you know, to have people just be literally impossible to kill. Yeah. When did Wraith King's ultimate be reduced from 60 seconds to 40 seconds? A few patches ago. Like, that's just like, it is 40 seconds already. Like, like we really can't reduce it any more than that. Holy shit, you guys are still here. Go do something. You know what? I'm going to go farm your creeps now. Screw you guys. I'm going to go over here. Yeah, I mean, uh, you're farming ours. I'm going to go hit yours. Ugh. <laughs> I mean, that's, 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 that's fine. That's fine. No mana cost? Well, that's the talent, right? No reincarnation mana cost. At level 25, you can uh, choose between reincarnation costs, Wave have Rayfire Plus or no reincarnation mana cost. I'm gonna go with, uh, with the no mana cost today. I know that may seem a little bit weird, but I think it's better here. Because they do have Nyx and uh, Life... Uh, not Life Steel, but Mana Steel, Mana Burn. It's a very strong thing in this mod. The Fusil Blade is very powerful. I nerfed it recently. It used to be just insane. Um, but yeah, it's a very powerful item. So, come on. Oh, motherfucker. Help. I'm so sad. 
I'm just a sad Wraith King, running around, doing sad things. I'm sad king. Sad too king. Yeah. So let's just go back in here. Continue hitting some more creeps, right? What's the critical strike percent at max level? 700%. Or 400%. That's pretty powerful. That's a lot of damage. It's actually really powerful. Holy shit. <laughs> That hurts, yeah. Definitely something you need to respect. I'm also maxing this out first, because it works against bosses. Bosses are considered non-hero units, right? So you can critical strike bosses and just do, like, massive amounts of damage. It's really powerful. So, that's a little bit there. Big thing that we added into the game, by the way. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be excited about it, but uh, Divine Rapier is now affordable. You can actually buy it. It is very expensive. As it should be, in my opinion. But it is possible to buy it. I'm gonna go TP, boys. I'm not gonna go power trits. Yup. We're gonna go in and see uh, you know, how we can make our support Wraith King work. Okay, I'm, I need to kill this first. And then I need to accept my fate and die. <laughs> That's the next step of my plan. It is to... Accept that we are going to die and just kind of prepare yourself mentally for it and just say, yep, this is my it's my life now. This is how we uh, will proceed from here. Let's go and get started on the Radiance. Yep. Grab this. Uh, if you don't die, you can get the Rapier. I could. <laughs> so we may or may not do that. Like, if we, we we first need to get all of the other shit we need, which is, we need a lot of it. And Master Burns, thank you for the sub. I very much appreciate that. It's very kind of you. Thanks. Um, but, as I was saying, uh, yes, actually, that is something that we can consider here. We could try to go for a Divine Rapier. Now, it's going to be a little while, because, again, it is very expensive. But, um, yeah. Definitely a possibility. Let's see. Just gonna become, like, super difficult to kill first. <laughs> That's step one. Step one is becoming unkillable. Step two is, uh, getting ourselves the Divine Rapier. Oh, man, you you just... Yeah, that definitely... I'm, I'm definitely keen on that. I, I gotta admit it, that sounds, that sounds kind of fun. I wanna do that now. I want to do that now. Oh my god, can you people stop it? Holy shit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Heal, heal, heal. No, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Alright. Fuck him up, fuck him up. No, 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 fuck him up, fuck him up, fuck him up. Fuck him up, fuck him up, fuck him up. Kill him. Rot him. Yes. Nice. Wait, did they steal our ancient camp? Or did we take it? Oh, thank God. I was really worried there. That would be a huge problem. That would be a huge problem if they stole our ancient camp. If you lose your ancient camp, then you... You are in a, in, 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 in a bad shape. Like, that's a real issue. So, yeah. Are you going to add jungle camp indicators? Maybe indicators for a boss? <laughs> that is one of those things that is not as easy to do. As you may think it is. Uh, believe me, if it was as simple as just saying minimap have jungle camp indicators, there would be jungle camp indicators. It would have been there for a long time. Sadly, it is not that easy. <laughs> so, yes. Um, but uh, as soon as we have it, oh well, but it's definitely something I want. Like, let me just put it that way. It's definitely something I want. It is that easy, is it? The last time we checked, it really wasn't that easy. Like, the last time we checked, that feature of building the minimap did not work whatsoever. So, sadly... We... M I guess we may have to take another look. That was a little while ago. But again, last time we checked, it just straight up didn't work. Alright. Get Battle Fury. I'm not going for Battle Fury here. Again, I, I'm, I'm going more for support Wraith King. I'm not going for like main carry, right click, super spooky dude. Nice. 
Nice, nice, nice. Oh, we can snipe this. Oh my god, snipe it, snipe it, snipe it. Hook him, hook him, hook him. Oh, he's level 10. Holy fucking shit, he's level 10. Okay, we got him. Mmm, that is a bit of a problem. Wow, they have a lot of levels, man. I'm just gonna die here. Please kill me. I did not have enough mana. Never mind, never mind. That is old Wraith King that needed 140. <laughs> New Wraith King needs 160. Uh, please forgive my ignorance. <laughs> we tried. Oh, man. I didn't even check my cooldown, I just like checked if I have 140 mana. Okay, well this is a bit of a problem. I'll be fine, but I still wasted my ultimate. Oh well. Vladimir's and Wrecking. Vladimir's a super good, but I'm not gonna go for it. But it is very powerful. Man, these guys are like all in our face all the time. Ooh, man. Fuck him up? Yes. The, they're diving really deep. And we're struggling a little bit to fight, but it's not impossible. Like, we're definitely keeping them out and making them pay for it. We need to get our farming course. So we, we should really make sure to kill a boss now. Like, very important, very important. Like, after this duel, let's go and kill this guy up here. It's the first boss stronger than Roshan in regular Dota. Um, super late. It's not stronger than super late game Roshan, but it is stronger than early game Roshan. Something like that. It's kind of difficult to like properly assess the power level because like there's a lot of like different mechanics that go into it. And um, but I would say yeah, there's definitely a difference. Um, like if we be able to kill. Roshan at this point in regular Dota, then Roshan would be easier, I believe. Hmm, actually, maybe about the same. I don't know, it's a hard call. <laughs> what can I say? It's a hard call. Ah, man, we're getting, getting punished here. Now, what we need is we need to get ourselves the first Roshan kill here. Right, like this will help a lot. Get us our farming course. Okay, I would like to not die, I'll be honest. Because I do actually hit pretty hard. No! Damn it. <sighs> we don't have a tank. Which is kind of a problem. Just keep the damage going. Like, we can come back in and such and, like, just kill him over a few deaths. Like, that's perfectly fine. God, he's wrecking us, though. Yeah, we are in bad, bad shape here. <laughs> okay, we got him, though. <laughs> Good. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. Your aura isn't working. Is it not? No, I think it is. Pretty sure it is. Yeah, no, I've got life still. No, it's definitely working. So. Yeah. Okay, uh, killing this now is a very good idea. Just because that will spread money. You know, we have TP boots. Uh, really? Am I the only one with TP boots? Okay. <laughs> well, I guess Techies is planning for, you know, late game and such. But yeah, the TP boots will be nice and strong in terms of getting us some money here. Let us catch up. I mean, we can now afford our Sacred Relic. And our Radiance. Nice! Okay. Okay, now we're in good shape. You've you have to talk a little? No, no, no. Uh, you're misunderstanding how Empiric Aura works. <laughs> if I toggle the Empiric Aura, if I turn it on like this, then creeps aren't affected by it. Right? So, my team is always affected by it. Allied heroes are always affected by it. You just have the option of turning it off for creeps. Okay. Kill this. 
Making a lot of money. Hmm. Smacks out the stun for now, I think. Probably the most valuable. And 10 intelligence. Sure. Gotta be smart, right? <laughs> Why not? I mean, it's not like either one of them is really gonna matter. I think next up we want... Oh, that's rude. I think next up we just want the Octarine Core. Oh! That was a good crit! I like that crit. Dude, those are my favorite ones. The ones that are just like slow and just goes up into the air. Pew! Snipes them down. So smart. Yeah, so smart. So smart. Push one if you're so smart. Super smart. The smartest. The smart arenos. Go ahead and get us a level 2 ultimate. But I mean... I mean, Chad, you're the, you're the smartest. The smartest. Super smart. Smart kings. Can't, can't, oh, root, root. Please stop. Yeah, so this is kind of like why I'm gonna have to go for the, um, what's it called, for the no mana cost talent, because else the nooks will just keep mana burning me. Hello. Nice. Okay, radiance is online. So what else do we need? We need uh, Aghanims, we need Shiba, and I mean this is also gonna have, oh, what's it called? Hmm. Or it's not, just subscribe to Twitch Prime. Bomb me if you figured out what you're going to do about OAA support spells, the so supports are significant. Well, supports are significant, supports are really, really strong. They're just not good at killing bosses, right? Um, like this. Like, if you think supports are bad in OAA, then you need to play more support in OAA, because supports are very good. I just want them to be able to be better at killing bosses. And no, I still haven't, like, seen anything that I'm, like, super happy about it. Why Shiva? Why not AC? I, I guess we could go for AC. I don't know, I just usually, if I go for Octarine Core, I like having Shiva. Does that make sense? It's just, like, a matter of, like, yeah, I don't know. These two just go together in my head. Which one do we want? It's 100 more damage or 15 more movement speed? Let's go with the 100 more damage, I suppose. So what if I swagger? Is that what he says? What does he actually say? Like, does anybody... What does the guy actually say? Because it always sounds to me like, So what if I swagger? And I'm like, I'm not sure if that's what he actually says. But that's what it sounds like to me. Like, it sounds like, What if I swagger? I don't know, you can be swagger all you like, my man. Believe in you, believe in yourself. No, believe in your swagger. You can be swagger. Oh, man. I don't think I'm getting this. God, you people are annoying, you know that? Give me a crit. One time. I can't do anything about that, Nooks, like that. It's old English, but what does he actually say? Or does swagger, like, have a different meaning? Like, I would assume so, like... <laughs> I assume swagger means something else in Old English. So it does actually say, so what if I, so what if I swagger? That's pretty amazing. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with this. <laughs> I'm very much okay with this. So what if I swagger? Chad, so what if I swagger, huh? So what? Go ahead and beat up that Wraith King. So I suppose if we want to go for the Assault Karas, uh, or, like, if we want to go for the Divine Rapier later on, then Assault Kuras would be better uh, instead of going for the Shiva's Guard, because the attack speed is going to be nice. This also makes me think about the level 20. I'm probably going to go for the 40 attack speed or the 10% lifesteal aura, because I feel like 40% lifesteal is enough. Right. Skysor Jr., thank you for the sub. Very much appreciated. Using that Twitch Prime wisely. Or nicely. I don't know. Maybe there's a better way to use it. I'm not an expert on Twitch Prime usage. Okay, we've got a lot of money now. Lots of money now. So yeah, com coming back is pretty possible, as you can see. Sell this, sell this. Grab ourselves that Aghanims, and I guess the Sword Kuras, right? Hmm. That seems reasonable. And we've got a slot left. 
I wonder what we should put in there. Hmm. Alan, but I'm currently reskinning all the boss models for the new trophy function in boss arenas. That's nice. That sounds like a good thing to have. That is good shit, my man. Good shit. What's up with the newcomer stream? Uh, it, it, it exists. I have nothing to do with it. That's what's up with it. I don't know anything about it because, you know, I have nothing to do with it. You know, I, I think I tried my best, you know, like, I don't know. Like, I tried. Didn't expect it to work. It didn't work. Uh, it's like 90% of life. <laughs> so, what can you do? Hello, I'm coming back in. Okay, don't worry. I got, I got us, I got us agonims. Yeah, you can't continue wrecking things. So this, by the way, is kind of the problem with Wraith King's ultimate. You see how I, like, already died once in this fight? Uh, yeah, I'm back again. Right? Like, I'm, I'm just back in it again. And now they, like, oh, okay, there we go. Another death. But let's just go ahead and get a kill while we're dead. <laughs> easy game, easy game. Yeah, it's just so difficult. Like, again, reducing the cooldown on this is just... It's just not, not, not really a great thing to do. I'm not sure if I should go for the reincarnation cost if I blast. Because, like, the thing is, like, uh, yeah, I'm worried about mana burn, but actually the mana burn hasn't been that significant. Like, it's been okay. I've, I've still had mana. Oh, he's dead. Like, you're super dead. Okay. I'm not really that scared. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back. Always back. Although, maybe not always. Ooh, shit. Let me sub, please. Thank you for the three months. I will, you, you have my permission to sub. <laughs> I'm not sure why you're asking for permission, but you have it. You have been granted. So, three months in a row of that. Fucking sick. All right. <laughs> Meek Murphs are on point today. Meek Murphs are fucking quality. Grab this. Hmm. Yeah, I think later on the mana burn will be a problem. It's probably just a bad idea for the good to go for the mana cost thing, just to not take a risk there, right? We really don't don't want to like run into any problems. No, no, I'm not gonna risk it. It's just not worth it. All right, this is gonna be an easy pickoff. I mean, at this point. <laughs> At this point, it just doesn't really, doesn't really, um, make a difference, I suppose. Like, it's just not difficult anymore. Okay. Grab this. There is tier two, yeah, a bunch of tier twos. I mean, I would like to, like, continue killing tier ones. I mean, if you guys are quite... What is the, oh, okay, that's the easy one. Oh no, I died. Oh, since I died. Okay. Go and get started. No shit. Unfortunate. Alright. Hello. Aww. Oh, give me that clings. Oh, give me that clings. You done fucked up, man. Thank you for being everyone's favorite German YouTuber. Well, I feel like you're really stretching it there, but thank you for subscribing. <laughs> I feel like I feel like everyone's is, is maybe a little bit off the truth, you know, just just mildly off target. But but I'll uh, th thank you, thank you. Oh, let me grab this. Oh no. Okay. Stun him. Suck it. Wait, no, I'm gonna die! <laughs> oh, that is unfortunate. <laughs> I died. Push F to pay respects. Get a heart. Uh, I'm thinking about that, yeah. Get this, thank you. We've got a level 2 Octarine now. I wanna get the refresher going as quickly as possible. Can use mana burn on bosses. Can you? Huh. I mean, yeah. Like, I'm not worried about it because it does nothing, so you probably shouldn't. But you also shouldn't be able to, I think. You don't have slots left? 
Are we going for the rapier? Is that like just part of our strategy now? Okay, okay. I guess rapier is just part of the plan. So I don't have the slots left. <laughs> yeah, I guess yeah. if we're going for rapier, then I just do not have the slots left. Oh, no, 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 no. No, Pachi needs to tank. Pachi needs to tank. Because if Pachi doesn't tank, we don't have anybody that really can. But he really needs some more armor. Okay. I'm gonna die, but that's fine. Yeah, okay. Should be fine. So do we get the refresher core right now, or do we just go for the radiance? Hmm. Okay, good. Got him. Sorry, Pudge, you're dead. <laughs> Rip, Pudge. Oh well. You already don't have slots, to be honest. No, I do. I do have. I do have slots. Like I can absolutely go for the, uh, for the rapier with my current item set, because I'm gonna like. I mean, Refresher combines with Dr. Inkor, right? So it's just like, those two items are going to be one item. Okay, let's go with the no mana cost then. I just want to make sure I'm protected as best as possible. I was kind of thinking maybe I should max out my Radiance first. I don't know. But yeah, no mana cost on this is pretty nice. Like, it's just kind of like, hey... We're gonna make sure we don't get a, a caught of guard by anything here. Especially if we do want that right here, that's gonna be important. Okay. Good, uh, so we've got this. Well, I guess since we are going for this at some point anyway, we might as well buy this for 60 more damage, right? <laughs> it's just like, yeah, I guess. I mean, we'll take 60 more damage. Why not? Why not? Lucian's? Nah, 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 nah. We're gonna go for just good old Radiance. It just works well on Wraith King, you know. It's a good item on the guy anyway, and we've got Octarine Core, and we want Octarine Core if we're gonna go for Divine Rapier. This does make sense. Like, this item build is, is fine as is. Don't really need to change anything about it. Oh. Okay, bit of a problem. Is that Mana Burn? Yeah, that's a Diffuser Blade. Okay, well then I'm very happy that I went for the uh, talent I went for. Okay, um, yeah, we're just gonna die. That's fine. Okay, run away, run away, run away. Activate this, blast him. Resurrect. Okay. We only need to live for a tiny little bit. We don't even need to survive for all that long. Oh, can I, can I just kill him? <laughs> nice. That was a little bit unexpected. Yeah. Okay, we're not gonna make it. That is unfortunate, but we can definitely still do a bit of damage. Oh, god damn, these stuns. Wow. Wow. We're just getting overwhelmed by that. Okay. Well, that will be a problem. Hmm. Maybe we should go for Lucian's then. Some more survivability. Oh, I don't know. I'm scared. I'm scared, boys. I'm very scared. I'm scared of myself. Of the of the item I will eventually have. Okay. Oh, boss time. Okay. I'm gonna sit in the back. I got a few seconds left until I can have my reincarnation, so. Oh, actually, never mind. It's not even really a problem, is it? Okay, well, that guy is fine. I'm gonna go ahead and beat you up. Ah. Oh, Techies, fuck him up! <laughs> oh, let's go! 
The 250 attack damage techies. <laughs> oh, that is that is amazing. That is so funny. That is so funny. Okay. Okay. Well, that worked pretty well. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that techies just carried us. Definitely did. Okay. What well, is this a bit of a silly fight up here, isn't it? <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is hilarious. That is so funny. Okay, he's gonna burrow again. There's more stuns. An endless supply of stuns. Oh, oh, he got him! Oh, shit! Oh, you done fucked up. Nice. Okay. Where's the techies? I mean, techies actually hits really hard. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's actually dealing massive damage. That is very, very amusing. I love that stuff like that is possible. Right, like, so the thing is, like, I haven't really been doing a lot of balance recently because, like, the game just seems really balanced to me. Like, I'm just like, what needs fixing? So I'm just really taking a very slow approach right now. You know, just making sure that everything that I, I'm gonna, like, change something about actually needs to be changed and such. Okay, got that. Because <clears throat> there isn't, like, anybody that's, like, an obvious problem. I mean, the Chen thing, right? And I saw, like, some people were unhappy with, like, how, how I think about the Chen thing. And I just want to, like, say this. Like, first of all, I'm not in charge of the farming cave. Like, people seem to think that I am, I myself am the one making every single thing about this mode. No, I outsource creeps. Like, I don't handle creeps myself. I handle heroes. Right? Like, I balance heroes, I don't balance the creeps. And if there is something that needs to be balanced about the creeps, I tell Haganeko what I want to be changed, and Haganeko hopefully changes it the way I want it to. Um, in this case, he didn't. Right? Like, in this case, he didn't actually change things the way I wanted them to. I didn't, I never wanted the creeps to be this powerful. Um, but, again, the entire farming cave is being reworked right now. So it's just like, I just don't see it as a big problem. Because it's just like, oh, whatever. It's gonna be, like, reworked anyway. So why make a big fuss about it? it? Seems like a bit of a waste of everybody's time to, you know, try to balance something that will be changed significantly in the coming future anyway. Oh, come on, man. Hello. Thank you. It is still the invisible Nyx. <laughs> oh my god. We're lining ourselves up so nicely for him. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Well, I think it's time for me to go, right? Oh, man. No! No! Oh, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> we got one of them. We've got one of them. Nice. And yeah, that's another thing you need to keep in mind, right? Like, everybody working on the mod is just doing it because, like, they enjoy it. Alright? So there are some jobs that nobody enjoys doing, and that I don't know how to do, that just don't really get taken care of that quickly, because it's really difficult to motivate people to do those jobs, right? 
And usually I just take it on myself. Usually if it's something that I can't just fix, like for example, um, you know, like there was a period of time where like I had to like go and change every single stun duration in the game. So I just did that. I just sat down for a while and changed every single stun duration in the game. But... Dude, like if you can't stop being so annoying, that would be really convenient. I hate this nook. God damn it. Yeah. But there's just some things nobody wants to do. Because they're just not really fun to do. And the problem is, if, you know, with it not being a paid project, is that there's nobody that we can just be like, you go do that. Because everybody's like, no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> so, yeah. And, uh, again, usually I try to take on those tasks myself and just handle it myself. Uh, except when I can't, because I just don't know how to do it. And then we usually have a problem that is not easily solved for a little while. You know what I mean? Okay. Well, oh, that is very unfortunate. Okay, well, that doesn't seem like that's how it should work. That That is a bit of a disaster, actually. Please, no next. Oh god, of course. Well, alright. I'm back. Guess who's back? Back again. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god, this looks. Dude, I've had enough of this shit. Holy fucking shit, man. How do we deal with this nooks? I guess BKB, right? Wow. This motherfucker. Well, that has to be the most annoying thing in the universe. So, like, an example of things that really need to be done and nobody's wanting to do it, so it's just not happening. Um, I would really like it if... Uh, if... You, if there were more options to deal with invisibility. And I have laid out plans on how to do that. <laughs> but nobody's doing them and I don't know how. So that's just kind of not really happening recently. Which is a bit unfortunate like that, but there's not much I can do. Fruya, Fru Fruya66666, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. It's very nice of you. Very much appreciate it. Yeah. Yes, there will be ways to deal with invisibility. <laughs> it's just not in yet. And now you know why it's not in. Because it's just like nobody's doing it. If you feel like doing it, it's on GitHub. Like, it's on GitHub. Just go on the GitHub and just like... Make it and then pull request it. And then we can put it in the game and then it's fixed. It's the nice, nice thing about open source project, you know? open source projects. You can just like fucking do it and then it's done. Get up. Just go and get up. Alright. Uh, I don't like the idea of an edible gem. I think an edible gem is something that will result in um, people literally just spamming edible gems forever. Making invisibility completely pointless. I don't want invisibility to be useless. I just want it to not be broken. Right? Stop attacking him, monkey. And techies. You're interrupting his charge. You're slowing us down. Go, 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 go. Right, I don't want invisibility to be useless. I just want it to be more something you can deal with. Oh, nice. And making it so that it just completely doesn't exist anymore is definitely not a way of doing that. Like, it's just like, making an edible gem, okay, how much does it cost? What's the cooldown on it? I think, like, it's just, it's just not the solution to the problem. It's just not the solution. So, yeah.
I think I think the way to deal with invisibility isn't gem, but it is dust. Now that may sound a little bit weird. I'm just like, okay, but I mean, how the fuck is that helpful, right? Like, what does that even mean? Um, but I just want, like, instead of making gem wildly available, available with an edible gem, I want to make dust a bit more available by implementing it on other sources. Making it so that, you know, you can have dust and, you know, use that to uh, deal with invisibility. Your king moves of his own accord. So, yeah. No, Donald Tusk! So... Yeah. Wasn't it supposed to be on scan? Yes, it's supposed to be on scan. That's where I want it. Right? Like, by putting it on scan, we're making it wildly available. We're making dust wildly available. Oh, shit. I thought he already... Uh, I thought he already locked on. We're making dust wildly available... While still being able to regulate its cooldown, it doesn't take an inventory inventory slot, which is really, really important. And um, it's not completely free. You know? And everybody has it. So, yeah. Okay, we've got the uh, level 4 Assault Cross now, which is nice. It's going to be helpful to the team. Level 4 Radiance as well. I'm not sure if we can go for the um, Divine Rapier here. I'll be honest, like it just doesn't seem like a good idea. Motherfucker. It's motherfucking bullshit. I've had enough of it. So go suck my dick, you piece of fucking shit. Got him. I like BKB. <laughs> I like BKB. Save a tier 3 core for rapier. We're gonna get plenty of tier 3 cores. Don't worry, we don't need to save one for rapier. It's fine. I'm not scared. Do it again. Do it again! Because if you want to kill me, you're gonna need to do it a few more times. Do it again. There we go. Go ahead and fuck you up. Refresh. Couldn't do it again. Well, I didn't think so. Got him. Okay, we gotta gotta get rid of this. Yeah, Monkey King disconnected. It's kind of a little bit unfortunate. Nice. The big crit. The big crit. But yeah, you see, right now we have fifty-four thousand gold. So, like, what? How much money does Gem cost? Is it a thousand? Like, your edible gem. How much do it does it cost? A thousand? But well, it means late game, everybody has it all the time. But then, let's make it cost ten thousand. But that means nobody has it in the early game. Do we make it upgrade over time? Like, the first gem costs a thousand, the second one costs two thousand, the third one costs four thousand or something. Alright, could do that. But then, what's stopping me from, like, just buying the first one later on in the game? Oh shit, wow, that was quick. That guy does a lot of damage. Could you like, chill? That would be appreciated. Help! Okay. Oh, what? Come on! I was out! I was saved! Wow. Edible gem is not the solution. It is not. What it is, is it's easy, it's obvious, it seems like it would work, other game modes have it. That's what it is. But it is not the solution, and it is not what I want. So, we're gonna have something else instead. Well, once somebody implements it. <laughs> not not right away, of course. Drop your AC. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, 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 that's still going on. That's a bit annoying. Don't worry, I dropped my AC. I dropped my AC. We need to kill bosses. Like, really more so than anything else. Yeah, yeah, I know AC isn't working. Don't worry, I already dropped it. It's all good. We got it under control. Oh, nice, we got a Shiva's God, finally. <sighs> Hello, I'm back. Hope you don't mind that. Yeah, I'm just like chilling. The demo of the Dominator is sonar active. You mean like a scanning active? You know what? What we could even do is we could have it on the helm of the Dominator, but everybody has a helm of the Dominator all the time. But it isn't in your inventory and it doesn't give you any stats or any benefits. But it is also just powered of a different button on the interface. And we'll put it like right on the minimap and like right next to the with the um, ward button. Yeah. Yeah. That's where we'll put the sonar. Alright? Does that sound good? I think that sounds good. God damn it, you motherfuckers. Okay, do we need to buy time? I think we need to buy time. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, I didn't get off the refresh. <laughs> now unlock here, yes, I would like to upgrade this. Okay. Oh man, oh nice, good kill. Okay. So I think like my supporting like play here is kind of working, honestly. Go fuck yourself, man. I've had enough of your bullshit. Oh, the resurrection. But you see, like I'm just frontlining really, really hard, and that was the entire goal all along, right? Like it was never about just killing everybody, dealing massive damage. It was just about frontlining super hard, and I am frontlining so fucking hard right now. Oh, heart transplant, that's amazing. Oh my god, if you just keep heart transplanting me, I can actually get a rape here. Alright boys, let's go kill a tier 4. Let's go kill a tier 4. It's rape your time. I wanna, I wanna kill a tier 4. It's rape your time. It's rape your time. No. No, we can't do it. Like, with that heart transplant, we can't actually do it. Edible rapier. Why don't we make every item edible? Why not edible Daedalus? Why not edible fucking everything? Edible Shiva's guard. Edible Assault Cross. Edible dick. Bring him back here. Hey. I hope you don't mind this. Come back here. Okay. Who's in charge here? <sighs> I like Rape King. This <laughs> worked pretty well, right? That was pretty nice. I'm pretty okay with that. Okay, we're dropping TP boots, right? Like, we need to keep BKB. We need to keep BKB. We can't drop BKB. We're dropping arcane boots. That's what we're dropping, right? So. Yeah. Oh god, I am so excited. Are you excited? Are you excited, chat? Look at my damage right now. It's, it's 200 plus 209. 335 with the heart transplant. But after this, oh man. Are you excited? I am so excited. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at my damage output. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go kill bosses. Let's go kill bosses. I'm very slow. But like like I <laughs> I just like punch up bosses now, right? <laughs> This was such a terrible idea. 
Such a terrible idea. Oh my god, I do 21,000 damage crits on these guys. Holy shit. Okay. Give me a crit. One of them. Oh, <laughs> oh rest in peace, let's charge you. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. I deal a little bit of damage, you know. I would say I hit pretty hard now. Charge BKB? Charge BKB doesn't have proper stats. It's not really... That's something I should do. I should fix up charge BKB. There's still some items that are missing proper stats. Something I should do soon. Okay. Oh. Wait, when did he die? Why did he die? Okay. I don't have enough money. Mefto, thank you for the sub. One to go to the 400. Okay. Okay, we're fighting. Let's fight. Let's fight. I'm so excited. Are you excited? Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god. Bring I mean that guy is super squishy. He's got like no HP. He's only he only went for damage, but still. I'm so slow. But I don't have anything else I can drop. Bring him back here! Come on! Stop running! Oh I hit! Oh gimme, give gimme, give gimme give that. Oh that did nothing. <laughs> that did literally no damage. Alright. Okay. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Fuck him up. Okay, final duel. Final duel. This is it. This is what we've waited for. This is this is what dreams are made of, my friends. Oh, no. Sorry, techies. Yeah, that is a little bit unfortunate. We need to fix that. Oh, he's already, he's already here. Okay. I'm gonna die. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We already have one death. Okay. Well, we killed him. Uh, we just, like, refresh here. I only got to attack once. <laughs> I only got to attack a single time here. Okay. I think we can change it like this. Get ourselves that movement speed. Bring him back. Bring him back. Yes! I hit, I hit, I hit, I hit, I hit, I hit. Come on, my man! Bring him back here! One hit! One hit! Shit! I've got resurrection again, so it's all good, but... Oh, man. Oh, I didn't have the special code on it. I think I'm just gonna, like, wait here for my haste. I mean, that's what this mechanic is in the game for, right? Okay, we're not gonna wait for double damage. Because that's just anticlimactic. No, 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 no. We gotta do it, we gotta do it. With it up. You motherfucker! He denied himself! <laughs> you son of a bitch! You son of a bitch! He denied himself! Oh, man. We got wrecked, boys. We got wrecked so hard. Oh, shit. Alright. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, please don't forget. To <laughs> please don't forget to leave a rating on the video. <laughs> that was a fun game. Pretty close, too. Yeah, so anyway. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and goodbye.